Cargill's history in Montana dates back to a grain project in Valier in 1908. Now the Minnesota-based ag company is embarking on a new venture headquartered in an exciting new facility. The Montana Ag Network recently got a first-hand look. Walking into Cargill's new facility north of Great Falls is like stepping back in time. We look to make it look like an old elevator that you would see in the past. Um, we brought in reclaimed wood from across Montana and after the fact we found out the bulk of that wood came from an old Cargill elevator in Hingham. While the company made the 18,000 square foot building look like a page from the past, it did so with an all-inclusive eye to the future. The company is looking to make a major agricultural impact with its multi-purpose Omega-3 canola project. Um, number one, canola will be a great rotational partner for our growers in the area. Um, number two, it's a highly sustainable project. Um, the amount of Omega-3 that, that we get from 160 acres of our crop will replace 1.7 million pounds of fish being taken from the ocean. Canola is catching on in Montana. Two years ago, there were 60,000 acres grown, last year 100,000. Montana is already the nation's number one pulse crop producer, and canola will help growers diversify even more. It'll give them the ability to have a broadleaf crop that they can control things that they couldn't control in their wheat and barley crop, and vice versa. The wheat and barley will complement the canola as well. Um, so we see the growers um, having another option um, and ultimately another market that they can be a member of. With field trials spread from Fort Benton to Valier, Cargill is hoping to cater to farmers in all parts of the Golden Triangle. We'll have a close to a thousand different varieties of canola in those trials. And we're really looking for that needle in the haystack. What's the hybrid that's really going to perform in, in that area? Um, you know, what works in Fairfield may not work in Conrad, and what works in Conrad may not work in Fort Benton. The Great Falls location currently has six employees, but could employ up to 20 in the future and the facility could well become a one-stop shop. When our customers come in, if, if they want to know what's coming in the future, we'll have the people on the R&D side that can tell them what's coming five, six years down the road. Um, if they want to buy canola in the future, they'll have a sales team that they can come straight to and ask those questions. Cargill's Great Falls facility also features a summer internship program. This year, two students from Montana State and one from Iowa State will work in the Electric City.